Well, here we are. It's uh, April 14th, 2003. And as you can see, we've had a change of scenery for once. We've done several albums in a row at Bear Tracks. And now we are out on my old home turf of Long Island. And we're at Cove City Studios, our first time recording here. And uh, we're just moving in today and getting ready to start cutting drums and basic tracks. about to embark Let's on the rock. start of a new album. Ah! Bert, can you punch him in uh, on the third verse? The one where it's going 4-4, four, 9-8, four, 4-4, four, four, 11 eight. Uh, We spent about two weeks doing the drum tracks. What I would do is I would actually go in and play the song down maybe three or four times and then I would sit down with a piece of paper and a pen and actually make notes on which, you know, okay, the, you know, the, the best verse one was from take three and the best chorus one was from take two and basically made notes on all of the drum parts that I thought were the strongest and, cap and executed, you know, the part properly. Take one. Take two. Take three. Okay, drum tracks are done. We have moved studios after three weeks at Cove City Sound. We are now right down the block at Pi Studios and we are halfway through the heavy guitar tracks. So, come on in. Once we had the basic tracks finished, we moved over to another studio on Long Island called Pi Studios. And that's where we did the remaining overdubs, which were the keyboard tracks, the bass tracks, uh, some of the guitars, uh, additional guitar work, and then uh, all of the vocal five. stuff. Back in action? Back in action.
if you can handle that one run. I still think it was a bit much. Shall I do one without it and keep that? So I, think, I don't even think you need to keep that. I think you can get a better one. And also that climb was super exaggerated. I don't think you need that much. Fantastic. The very end. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, the uh, final chord. The final arpeggio. Oh. Maybe this. Yeah, yeah. That's like picture perfect right there. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. CD of what you got? Sure. So there's not that much left to go. We have to do strings. There's a sound effect I want to catch. Mm -hmm. were good. Although there was one, uh, ba -da -da, uh, ba -da -da -da, whatever it was. I think it was that bum bum bum. No, what the hell is that? Awesome. The effect is great. How could you make keep that effect but make his main voice like an octave lower? I know you can. Be at one with God. And then 
That's fucking sick. These torments and ghosts of yesterday will vanish when exposed. You can't hold on to your secrets. They'll only send you back alone. Like Dave Mustaine meets Satan. Your fearless admissions will help expel your destructive obstacles with my help. I know you can. <laughs> Be at one with the gods and men. Get your swords out for the fucking fight. As Dave Mustaine meets Satan. Oh, that, that the trailing off shit is awesome. That is awesome. Let me hear rep three. The torment ghost beast. These tormenting ghosts of yesterday. Turn up! All of our accusements, we try to make sense of surviving together, but they make a blood. Nice job! Fucking great! <laughs> One more! <laughs> We try to make sense of surviving together while living apart. You know, there was some weirdness in there, though. Give us a little more light. He wants more light out here, Duck. Just for a moment. How can a man fucking shoot anything in his fucking lighting? Ah, nice. It'll be really cool from up there. No, this is good. I got you. I got the. No, that's plenty. That's more than enough. So just get a endless sacrifice. Can you just play it once? We'll get the timing or length. Okay. That was great. That was the one. That was the one. That was great, man.